I think that uh, communication uh, can really be important part of this project, especially if we want to spread the news of what we are doing. And I think we are doing a really good job uh, for this sport, for the people who are disabled to include, it, include them into our sport. And I think that we can really do much uh, with all these modern ways of communication and to people to see from the first hand what we are doing and what it's all about. I think that the biggest challenge in sitting volleyball is moving part. Uh, since it's quite unnatural, uh, you have to sit on, sit on the ground and uh, move with your hands and legs. So I think that uh, kids might have uh, most problems with this part. But otherwise I think that it's a really nice game and I think that the kids will love it. Uh, I hope so, uh, and I think that the project is a very good uh, idea and I hope that it will be as good as it seems that it will be. <laughs> the school is the basic part of sport or the, where the children can get to know sport better or even be pushed a little bit and maybe Lena could give this information from the first hand. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean definitely schools are a place where Everything happens when you're young, so I think that um, bringing sitting volleyball to schools is very important. Uh, it's very good inclusion, uh, so uh, I think it's important that also able kids uh, try it, um, because I always say that uh, sitting volleyball is perfect sport because everyone can play it, uh, so I think that's a really nice 